Hello, I'm Josh from Ting Tai Chi, and with White Crane Stretches Wings, we're going to work on a forward and backward rotational movement in the shoulders. This will allow us to loosen and open up our shoulders, alongside which the bonus of this exercise is that we're going to massage our hips and our psoas muscles. And this is important because this beginning set of qigongs that we would normally lump this in with actually act as a warm-up qigong, kind of like a stretch for our tai chi practice to get us ready for the tai chi practice to follow. So what this means is that we would almost always be in our uh, natural stance for quite a bit. And this can get our legs a little tired. So we're going to make sure our blood is circulating and we're really focused on our proper posture. So to do this, I'm going to make what's called an ox tongue with my hand. That means nothing more than my, my fingers are together and my thumb is felt folded in against the center of the palm. Once I do that, I'm going to place the index finger side of my palm, uh, of my hand, against the upper side of this triangle that this, your legs as in a squatting position make. And with this, I'm going to rotate my elbows forward and my shoulders forward. I'm not hunching. I'm not bending forward to make this happen. Rather, I'm talking to my shoulders, allowing my elbows pointing forward to rotate my bones deep into my shoulder. And once this is forward, I'm going to press down. My fingertips press towards the ground. When I turn my palms to face each other, pinky side of my hand is now lying against my, my, the fold of my hips. And I'm going to pull my pinky side up and over my hips. And how that action happens is actually through the elbow being pulled backward behind me. So I'm not pulling my hands up, I'm actually pulling my scapulas together and my elbows together behind me. That pulls my palms to face up alongside my hip. I'm going to turn my palms back down and repeat the movement again. Go ahead and inhale back and exhale forward. If you have problems matching the breath with the movement, no worries. Just go ahead and try your best. Okay, let's see from the side. Excellent. Do it at least 10 to 20 more times before you're done for the day. And if you can, I'd work up to 100 over the next week while you wait for the next uh, Qigong to be uh, released on Tuesday. So again, I really appreciate your interest in Ting Tai Chi. This is a movement that looks weird, but we never ever do that rotational movement forward and backward, hardly ever in our lives. So I hope you take advantage of this and I'll see you next time on Ting Tai Chi.